Okay. Um, Rakana has double downed on the cuties, the cuties condition. Um, <clears throat> after it was pointed out that him defending cuties uh, is unconscionable and also a direct contradiction to his previous points. Uh, the Midnight Knight says, wait till Dax Herrera disagrees and Nick's 180s to align with his position, just like with Cuties and the Kiwi Farms. Rakita says, my position on Cuties has been identical this entire time. That's not true. I played, the, have I played? No, I've not played the clip. Josh, play the clip. I will, I will play the clip. Thank you, Josh. I, but I, this is uh, from Alyssa. She found the part, uh, Rakita's prior, prior stance on Cuties. You ready? You guys have to be as pissed off as me. Are you ready? This is the official Netflix trailer for Cuties. That's a fucking child. I think it's because it's out. Those are children. What do you call it, We're going to dance with the concours. These are kids. What? They're kids. <laughs> They're kids. They're 11 years old. They're kids! The only person with any sense in this thing is the mom slapping this little girl. Those are kids! Those are children. Those are children. They're 11 years old. What is it about? What is it about? Let me read the description to you. I'll show you. It's right here. Amy, 11 years old, tries to escape family dysfunction by joining a free-spirited dance clique named Cuties as they build their self-confidence through dance. Okay, chat. Here's the here's the here's what I'll ask. I'll go to kick and start a poll. Poll. Get ready to type exclamation point and vote and prepare to enter one or two. Do you think that Nick was pretending to care years ago? Years ago, or has his brain just gotten more holes since then? And then vote one for always duplicitous or brain holes have changed him and we'll do we'll do the poll we'll do the poll uh vote one if you believe that nick ricada has always been duplicitous and even this principled stance against the cuties movie was a mere facade designed to dupe pay pigs out of their precious currency or vote two if you believe that the alcoholic brain holes have simply bored too deep into his gray matter and he has actually undergone undergone a personal transformation in in terms of personality which have uh, retroactively made him look like a massive fucking hypocrite uh vote now oh yeah i'll play some music while you all vote some jeopardy music <laughs> All right, the votes are in. Uh, out of 107 participants, uh, 41 of them, 42 of them now even, 38.5% have believed that he was always duplicitous. And uh, 69 or 70, 62% uh, of these votes believe that the brain holes have fundamentally changed him. 
So there you go. Um, I, I, I really, I really don't know what to think. Part, I mean, I, I want to believe that he has changed because that absolves me of believing him. <laughs> if I, if I choose to believe that he uh, was just a liar, then that means that I fell for his facade chat, and that makes me look dumb. So therefore, I choose to believe that the alcohol has altered his personality chat. And therefore, I am absolved of any, uh, of any mistakes. Because I do not make mistakes, chat. No, 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 no. It's not coping. I simply reject your reality and substitute it with my own. That's not coping. Uh, that is called being base. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CACA Lofa. Remember to like and subscribe.